Scientists have just made a terrifying new discovery on Titan, one of Saturn's moons, that changes everything we know about this world and our place in the universe. This discovery threatens to shatter long-held beliefs and ideas about our place in the universe. Here's what you need to know and what it means for the future of humanity. Click here to continue reading. The discovery of methane in its atmosphere. To be more precise, there are three times as much methane in its atmosphere than originally thought. They even said that those findings could significantly change everything we know about other planets in our solar system. These are bold claims that would definitely catch any reader's attention. I would then go on to say what exactly changed and why it is so important. I also wanted to use they to give a scientific professional feel, but also add a human interest aspect by saying scientists instead of just researchers or something like that. The study titled Titan's Atmospheric Composition and Structure was published by a team of researchers from NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory. In it, they present evidence of a much larger methane supply than was previously thought. This is incredibly important because methane is what scientists use to determine what may have happened in other planets in our solar system. Specifically, Mars and Venus both had abundant amounts of methane at one point but lost them over time for unknown reasons. Knowing how much methane a planet has allows scientists to make assumptions about what happened on that planet. In short, we can better determine why Mars and Venus lost their atmosphere's methane and as a result, became what they are today. This may lead to scientists discovering just how common life is in our universe, specifically here in our solar system. It may even be possible that there is still some of that methane trapped underground on Venus or Mars waiting to be discovered. Scientists have made a terrifying new discovery on Saturn's moon Titan that might mean life has a different origin than we once thought. Studies suggest that water-based molecules were present on Saturn's moon long before the Earth was ever formed. The research, which explores how and when water formed in our solar system, also suggests that there are other places where alien life could develop. Scientists led by Amy Barr of Arizona State University found that hydrogen cyanide, HCN, is readily produced in chemical reactions involving sunlight and tholins, complex organic molecules created by solar radiation interacting with nitrogen and methane ices present on Titan's surface. The research team also found that hydrogen cyanide was abundant in a specific part of Titan's upper atmosphere. It was three times higher than previous observations had shown, revealing a larger reservoir of HCN than previously believed. This is an important finding, as it implies a potentially richer supply of HCN than previously thought, Barr said in a statement. HCN is one possible building block for more complex molecules and even biochemicals like amino acids, which are key to the origin of life. Black Lives Matter has a message for you. Paragraph 4, it should come as no surprise that black women activists have been leading movements against state-sanctioned violence for years. Scientists have found that life can be established without water. The findings come from a new study published in Science Advances, in which researchers at MIT have shown that if conditions are right on another planet, there might be a way for organisms to survive on much smaller amounts of water than previously thought possible. Furthermore, these organisms would not need access to liquid water. Instead, they could get their water from ice, or even from vapor in the atmosphere. Scientists have speculated on life without water for decades. In 1953, British scientist John Desmond Bernal suggested that cells could have evolved to be water-independent in order to survive in extremely dry conditions on Earth. However, it was unclear whether these organisms would actually need any water at all or if they could get by solely with ice instead. To find out more about how common a water-free lifestyle might be in space, researchers from MIT decided to take a look at one of Jupiter's moons, Europa. The moon is home to an enormous amount of liquid water beneath its icy surface, and as such, it is considered a prime candidate for harboring life elsewhere in our solar system.